Hello? Babe, I'm home. Hmm, where are they? Are they in the family room? No. Are they in the living room? No. Um, babe, where are you? Hmm. What was that? That crash? Babe, what are you doing? It's okay. It's okay. Just breathe in. Deeply. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. on the ground and let's talk about this I know you've been working on your anger issues lately and things like these are hard to control trust me I know so what happened that got you into this spiral in the first place was it a text from a friend? An update from your boss? Mm. Yeah, that seems really hard. I can't even imagine. I remember one time something similar happened to me and I felt the same way. Um, yeah, I guess I was wondering why you were throwing things around in our bedroom. That is a good, good question. Um, do you want to call your therapist? Do you think that would help? Okay. It's up to you, really. They're going to be probably more helpful than I am. I have all the love for you in the world, but it's just I'm not as knowledgeable as they probably are, you know? So, yeah. How about this? Let's go downstairs, I can make you some tea or something, and then we can clean up this room later. Yeah, we don't have to take care of it right now. This room is messy, and I'm glad I was able to stop you before you put a hole in the wall. So, yeah, let's take, take care of this later. Right now, we need you to go and take care of yourself on the couch and I will bring you any drink or any food or anything you want, within reason, of course. Alright, here is your tea, piping hot, just like you like it. Do you want any sugar or honey with that? All right, yeah, of course, I'll go get that. All right, here you are. Yeah, it's funny you should ask that because I've never really gotten in control of my anger either. It's, it's tricky, you know, like, there's th some things in this world that honestly just piss me off and um it's it's embarrassing but 
My school would always get mad at me for punching the walls and doing all sorts of stuff like that. Yeah, I got a lot of detentions. But it's these things, they shape who we are, for better or for worse. We grow because of these things, and these things change us. Like, think of it like a breakup. Hard times inspire growth, and it might seem bad in the moment, but in the end, it's, it's gonna make you stronger. And I promise, babe, I'm gonna be here through all of it, the good, the bad, and the beautiful. I'll be here for you. Don't worry. So, do you want me to comfort you, or are you in problem solving mode? Do you want help? How about let me put it this way. This problem of yours, what would you like to do about it? Alright. Yeah, that's totally fair. Yeah, so there's a couple things we could do. You could talk to someone you trust. I guess that's kind of what we're doing right now, is it? Yeah. Um... Is there anyone else you can talk to? Because I know, as I said before with your therapist, I might not be the right person to talk to. I love you to bits, but I just don't know everything that, uh, you know, professional might. And that's the thing. Therapists and doctors are here for a reason. If we didn't, if no one had any of these ailments, if no one had any of these, either depression, anxiety, anger issues, then there would be no need for doctors. So, <laughs> as stupid as it um, sounds, you're kinda helping give someone a job. You can look at it that way. I know that's silly. It's... <laughs> I know. You know, um, triggers are a funny thing, aren't they? Well, actually, they're kinda sad. Um... Like, if you think about it, there is just a word or something that somebody could say that if I heard, it would set me off. And I totally get that for you too. Everyone has their own triggers. And sometimes some are worse than others, you know? Like some when I hear about certain topics or certain subjects on the news, sometimes I cry. And I cry for a long time, and it's not fun. I get what you mean about triggers. <laughs> I'm pretty sure my school is still pretty upset at me about it though too, so. You never know. What are some of your triggers? Yeah. Don't say that. I mean, I would never think of you as invalid. 
it doesn't matter how small they are, you're not insignificant. You're totally valid. And I have nothing but respect for you. You should know this by now, baby. I love you. I know, I know. It's hard in the moment to see that. It, I, 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 I know. I know, I know, baby. It's, it's hard in the moment to see it. It really is. Um, I just want you to know that. Just, you can give me a call. If you need, if this ever happens again, just, just give me a call. It's honestly... No matter what I'm in, if I'm in a meeting or anything, if I'm... Doesn't matter what I'm doing, I'll always make time for you, baby. You don't need to worry about it. Don't worry about me. I just want to make sure you're okay. Come here, give me a hug. <sighs> I love you. You're gonna be okay. Yeah, he got this. Come on, let's go do something fun. Hey everybody, um... Just want to say thank you for the make making it to the end of the video, and if you enjoyed, uh, then go and like, subscribe, do all that YouTube stuff, and yeah, um, this is a little different from my usual videos, but I hope you enjoyed, and I hope it made you guys happy. Thanks. Love you guys. Bye.